vlog. Today you guys got a Tuesday vlog, which is like <laughs> kind of cool. One day I'll start doing daily vlogs. Ooh, what about in December? I should do daily vlogs in December. That'd be cool. Um, I'm going to the gym for the first time in a couple months. Not like I'm going in a couple months, like I'm going right now, and I haven't been in months. So that's fun. Let me get my Keith, my Kiv. Um, I forgot where. Oh, my car's over there. Okay. Um, yeah. So I have like two and a half weeks left in this apartment, and uh, oh, that did not lock my door. And um, gonna make the most of it. I start moving my stuff in this weekend. Oh, my parents won't be home, so get all the little stuff done. And then, oh, the bees are back. Fuck! Hate these bees. Hate these bees. Okay, I'll check it later. Bye. I did it. Alright, I'm at my aunt's house helping her with this daycare. And I'm trying to use her fucking can opener. And like... I have mangled this poor can. Guys, like, look at this. Like, I, I got, I figured that part out, but like. Fuck you, Pampered Chef. I'm just kidding. I love Pampered Chef. But yo, this can over it. It ain't it, sis. I just dented it even more. And I've tried the bottom too. Like, I cannot figure this out for the life of me. I don't know what else to do. I'm about to just take a hammer to it. Help. Okay, so these guys cried the whole day. Understandable, because the daycare's not only my aunt's house. But also, I've never felt so defeated by a can opener in my life. Also, I wasn't allowed to take pictures or report the kids, but this is just so sweet. Uh, although... Definitely, like, like, definitely confirmed my decision of not wanting kids just yet. Maybe, like, ten years from now when I'm, like, early 30s, maybe? I don't know, but definitely not now. Definitely not anytime soon. Okay, so if you've been watching for a while, then you kind of know that I have a lot of stomach problems. Don't mind the mess. I, again, packing to move back home with my parents. Ow! my foot that was not good um uh, yeah so i'm not lactose intolerant i'm just straight up allergic to milk but like i'm having trouble eating things that don't have milk in it why because my my diet is really all dairy honestly like there's a lot of dairy in my diet and i'm trying to cut it out Last night I had such a bad problem. I woke up several times with like a Charlie horse like cramp in my lower abdomen and then like it's still just lingering right now and I just, I'm not having it. I'm in pain and like I don't want to take Tylenol but like I also don't want to like be in pain anymore and like I took a bubble bath and everything and I'm just not okay. It just freaking hurts and like I don't know what else to do um I'm trying to cut dairy out of my diet but it, it's not exactly an easy thing to do for me um I'll be moving home with my parents in the next week or two and so hopefully then like I'll get on a good eating schedule and stuff like that but right now I am in pain man pain so yeah that's that Okay, here's an update. I just showered. I threw some laundry in. I did the dishes. Still have all this here, but it'll be gone by the end of the weekend. And tonight I'm going to my brother's house for dinner. So my parents are going to pick me up at like 5.30. It's like 4.30 now. Um, and yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, my cousin is going to Florida on Saturday. She's moving there. Um, she got accepted into her grad school, so I'm very proud of her. Um, she's going to become a chiropractor. She's going to be a doctor, and I'm very proud. And Alyssa, if you're watching this, I'm very proud of you. I know we don't see each other a lot, and I know that sometimes maybe we throw shade back and forth, 
occasionally, sometimes, I don't know, mostly me because I'm petty as hell <laughs> for literally no reason. But I love you and I'm proud of you and I cannot wait to see how far you're going to go with this because you are going to co- accomplish so much. Um, but yeah, see you guys. Well, this isn't the end of the video. Edit out. One of these days, I'm going to learn how to film myself properly when I'm out in public. But like, I still get nervous of people like staring at me even though I'm like completely alone right now. Um, I just went and got my mail, and I'm waiting for my parents to come pick me up, because, like I said in the last clip, my, I'm going to Brothers for dinner, and um, so now I'm going to put my mail in my apartment, and uh, wait for my parents. Apparently, they're stuck in traffic. My mom was like, it's normal 5 o'clock traffic. I'm like, it's 5.30. <laughs> we live in Fort Wayne. Traffic doesn't really exist. So I've been brainstorming a lot for the podcast this week, so... If you haven't watched yet, make sure you watch, because I think it'll be a good one. What's up, guys? I just got home from my brother's house um, from dinner. I didn't film there because I forgot, quite honestly. Um, But yeah, now I'm just going to do my normal routine of watching YouTube all evening while I wallow in (laughs) self-pity. I don't usually wallow. I sob. Anyway... Okay, so last night I was kind of fed up with my laptop not working with sound, okay? If you don't know, okay, why is my, okay, whatever. We're going on with shitty angles today. It's fine. I was fed up with my laptop not working with sound. I was like, God, shit and damn it. I'm like, I'm trying to just do stuff on my computer and I can't freaking hear anything And it was driving me nuts, right? So I took apart my laptop last night and I fixed it. I don't know even how I fixed it, but I fixed it. I took it apart, put it back together. I did a couple clicky things on the screen and boom, it's fixed. It's fine. Um, (laughs) I think I need to owe that to when I worked at Menards and I was a second assistant front end manager and half of my job was here, go fix the touchscreen kiosk in the front. Um, I felt like that was, like, a good chunk of my job, was to go fix technology that I knew nothing about. So, yeah, in a way, I guess you could say, like, I'm super tacky. Meanwhile, I can't figure out how to edit videos for shit. So whatever, it's all the same, right? Right. Um, I just watched the new Smoshcast, um, where Ian rambled to himself for an hour, which is fine, and then, (laughs) which actually was really interesting. He talked a lot about, like, uh, like, reality TV, and, like, I hate reality TV, but, like, for whatever reason, I found it interesting. I think it was just because it was him, because it was Smosh, okay, right? Anyway, um, again, TV's on autoplay, so now we're on to last week's episode, of the Smosh cast, which I've already seen like three times, but why did I just do that? See? See? The sound works! <laughs> I fixed it. Um, anyway, but yeah, now I'm just kind of listening to the Smosh cast in the background, um, and I am starting to work on my computer, but like actually work, not like work on the computer to like fix it, but like I'm doing work on the computer. Okay, you get it. Bye. <laughs> Guys, want to watch Google laugh at me? Huh? <laughs> this is nothing. This isn't even like. These are just like here. Download this app. They're the like Indeed. Don't even know what that is. But we're oh, let me, okay. Maybe it's not gonna laugh at me. We're gonna find out. Really, I really thought Google was about to laugh at me. Eight days ago. Ooh, that means it's still hot. Tomorrow. Oh, give me a second, guys. Good evening, and welcome back to News with Megan. Today we talk about avocados and what they wear for armor before we turn them into guacamole. Also, avocado toast is disgusting. Don't at me, bro. That was kind of actually, like, probably the worst news announcer voice I've ever done. Let's be real here. I just wanted to show off the fact that my hair isn't something other than a bun. <laughs> Look at it. It's pretty. I like it. <laughs> um. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> also, if you've watched this the vlog this far in, thank you. You are so kind because I'm kind of crazy and I kind of do my own thing, but 
that's that's what I do. That's, that's what I live for. It's this is why I don't put my hair down because I never know how to touch it and play with it. And I don't want to touch it and play with it. But look at here we are. Look at that because it sparkles in it. <laughs> it's twelve thirty in the morning. I haven't gone to bed before like three a.m. in like a month and a half. Somebody help me. I've been cursed. That's lyrics to a song. <laughs> what song is that? Um, if you know what song it is, let it let me know in the comments because I forgot. Oh wait, no, no, no. It's it's a Linkin Park one. I don't know. I know it's a Linkin Park song. Anyway. <laughs> okay, I got it. Good evening, and welcome back to News in the Ah oh, fuck. You know, I just. You know. I'm not good at sketches. I'm not good at bits. It's not my thing, but I want to be. That's the thing. Also, I'm thinking about doing a video sketch that's purposely just me fucking up. Or messing up. Sorry. Um. Yeah, really, that's, that's all I want. This might be part of that video. Okay, so as I'm sitting here on the floor of my apartment that's soon to be not my apartment anymore, um, I thought I would try some different accents in reading the first page in my gold journal. Because why not? This is my gold journal. I have one page written in it. I know, I am such an accomplisher. I know, I know, I know. It's wonderful. I get it, I get it. Okay, so like... The goals I want to accomplish need to be done by December 31st, 2021, or my life will be over. And I mean over, like O-V-U-R, over, okay? I'm gonna, like, lose 500 pounds. Because, like, I know I'm cute. I just have to, like, be skinny, right? Right. Um, I'm gonna pay off all my debt. To my drug dealers and my pimps, I promise. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm going to revamp my whole show. <laughs> Just the whole thing. You don't know what it is? That's cool. It's fine. It's coming 2021. I'll have a show. I promise. <laughs> um, I'm, I can't read what this one says. Um, so we're just going to skip it. I, I, I didn't write these goals. Um, my, my, um, my organizer wrote them for me. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm gonna work, like, so hard on this channel. Just, like, so hard. And on my show, too. I just, I'm working so hard on it, guys. I am trying to just really just make it out here in the world. And I I believe that these goals are just something that I can really do. And I am excited for them, guys. This is just something that I've just, I've really just manifested it into the universe. And I'm excited to see where it goes. Um, yeah. I it just, I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you so much for coming along. Bye. Okay, real quick, I feel like that last clip needs like a little bit of an explanation. Um, that is a character I'm working on. Her name is Lacey. Uh, she's very much so of like the influencer personality. And she's very preppy, very valley girl, very Barbie. And just all around, just kind of like <laughs> ditzy, but she's not ditzy, but she is. Um, and <sighs> she's one of my favorite characters that I'm working on. Um, her, you'll meet some of the people in her life. Her boyfriend's name is Chad. He's invisible. Um, and her mom is just always in her business. Just always. So if you want to see more of Lacey, Chad, and the mom, let me know. Um, even if you don't let me know, I'm going to do it anyways. <laughs> so just stay tuned. I am enjoying this.
not typically a big coffee drinker. I'm really not. But when I drink coffee, I like it strong. And I very much so just enjoy the smell of it alone. Um, if you've seen my TikToks or my Twitter, then you know that I didn't go to sleep last night. Why? Because being an adult sucks. I actually couldn't fall asleep. I tried to fall asleep for like hours and then eventually I just gave up. Um, and so I decided I was just going to start my day. That's that. I got a lot of cleaning to do. I'm exhausted. But for whatever reason, I can't go to sleep. So, here you are. You get tired, Megan, for Saturday. Anyway, do you like my bedhead? Bed Does it count as bedhead if you never went to sleep? Anyway, look at my coffee. Look at it. Can you just imagine how good this smells right now? Just go ahead. Like, let the smell-o-vision just hit you. Oh, wait. We don't have smell-o-vision? That's fine. Here. Just stick my phone in there. Oh. Look at that. Steam up the camera and everything. Oh, it smells so good. I love the smell of coffee. Even if I don't drink it, I still love the smell of it. So, my grandma gave this sign to my mom a while back. And my mom gave it to me when I moved out. Drink coffee. Do stupid things faster with more energy. For me, honestly, that just kind of means, like, nothing. <laughs> do stupid things with high energy all the time anyway. I don't necessarily need coffee for it, but it helps sometimes. Um, coffee just is anxiety. Hot bean juice for me. Hot bean juice with anxiety coming right up. Hey, boy. That's a lot of coffee, I know. I am now just sitting here waiting for my food to be delivered. It is September 12th, 2020. It's like 60 degrees outside. It really feels like fall. So this nice warm mug. Really. Ow, it's actually freaking hot. Um, but yeah. And I just, it feels like a full kind of day, you know? It feels very full like today. Might be the fact that I'm freaking freezing because I didn't go to sleep last night or whatever. What is this voice? I don't know. Bye. I was finally able to fall asleep this morning. Um, and now I'm up, I'm getting my day going, and I can't go anywhere because I can't find my wallet. I leave it in the same spot all the time, I don't, I don't really use a purse, and I can't find it. So I'm hoping it's like under the couch or something, because I don't know where else it would be. Quick update, I found it, it was under a blanket. Excuse my sweatiness, but I've been moving things. Um, I have to unpack the suitcase so I can take the empty suitcase home and repack it. So I'm going to time lapse that because it makes me have the motivation to do that. Sweatier than when I started that time lapse. Why? Because there's no AC in the closet and I have the attic. So it's like a bazillion degrees in the closet. Anyway, suitcase is empty. Ta-da! Also, that stuff you guys saw me throwing to the side, that's either my I'm getting rid of or I'm going to use as costumes for sketches. Don't quite know yet. Um, and there are sketches coming, so stay tuned. This room over here will be my office. Once all my parents' stuff is like moved out of here, they're just going to use that closet. But I get to use this for my office. And I'm excited. Ew, I'm so sweaty and gross. Anyway... I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here because I got a lot of other stuff to do today and I don't really want to have to be focusing on filming. What? Have you ever heard the truth before? <laughs> wow. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, hit that bell. Let me know what you want to hear about on the podcast. Let me know other things that I can do for the vlog. That'd be super cool. Let me know ideas for sketches. Anything you got, anything you want to tell me, put it in the comments below and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching.